Hey guys, welcome back to the Wandering Wind. I'm gonna do a quick um, <laughs> video for you guys. I wanna try and do some more, um, just gameplay videos for you guys. So I'm going to try. Hem, hi, hello. Attention mm. all passengers, attention all passengers. Oh, okay. Express is about to conduct a warp jump. All passengers, please gather at the main hall. All right. I repeat, the Express is about to conduct a warp jump. All passengers, please gather at the main hall. Main hall, huh? Okay. <laughs> hey, Pom Pom, what's long up? Enough, but at least mm. everyone's here now. <laughs> he won't be Where's here, Don, so just leave him be. Okay. Oh yeah, take. What's this? A tiny bonus from the conductor to the passenger. Think of it as an investment in your future growth. Okay. Ooh, hoo, hoo. excellent. I knew there was a uh, like a an adventurer's guild type thing. I just didn't know it was gonna be him. Okay, On level three. I go four, <laughs> seven, five, six, seven, eight, and nine. Excellent. Level fourteen gives me something interesting. Wonder what it, that is. Ah, trail ba blaze power, huh? Okay, interesting. Maybe at level 15 I'll get okay, something everyone. really good. Hurry up and find a place to sit down. Try not to be like March. Always running around the express <laughs> like a headless chicken. Oh come on. Why you gotta do that to her? Pom Pom's going to start the final preparations for the jump. Okay. The voyage continues. <laughs> Ooh, I get a friends feature. View the friends menu. Got it. Add friends via system recommendations or by searching with that UID. And view the friends you've added. Excellent. Awesome. Okay, wait for the jump. Have a seat on the sofa, huh? Sure. Let's wait for the next stop. Ooh. The universe. The universe. The Astral Express. Ooh. Eons. Beautiful. Did I get dragged into a science fiction movie or something? <laughs> a Stellaron thing. In my body. Are you the stars? <laughs> I've done stuff like that before. <laughs> but what's up with it you, wasn't stars for me, though. Come on. It was lights. Lights? Huh. When I first woke up after being rescued from the ice, I could see clusters of stars in front of me. Hmm. I reached out for them automatically, but they turned out to be the carriage ceiling lights. <laughs> That's so cute. The whole crew was watching me. <laughs> it was pretty embarrassing. <laughs> Rescued from the ice. Oh, I forgot to tell you. Oh, you did? Before all this, I was stuck in a huge block of ice drifting through space. Huh. Himeko and Mr. Yang and... Who was it again? Anyway, mm -hmm. they figured out a way to melt the ice and saved me. Ah. Who knows? I don't remember anything before that. Hmm. Who I am, where I'm from, my name, it's like everything's huh. erased from my mind. Dang. March 7th was the day they found me, so it stuck. <laughs> okay. Ever since then, I've been hanging out on this train and following it to whatever destination it decides to stop at. I'm hoping that one day, I can find my past. Aww. Uh, what am you I will. talking about this for? You will, March. A way to get everyone down, huh? Eh, sorry. <laughs> it's fine. 
I was the one who brought it up. Mm. <laughs> Cheer up. It's not every day someone gets to ride on the Astral <laughs> Express. Hey, you're right. Ah, you're right. Here comes the conductor. <laughs> the Express has reached a safe distance from the space station. We'll be jumping in about 10 minutes. Okay. Return to your seats, please. Both of you. Things could get bumpy. Uh, thanks, Pom Pom. But did you really have to come mm -hmm. and remind me? I'm not a newbie, you know. Yes, but you still made well, it through me. It wouldn't be necessary, but Miss <laughs> March 7th likes to challenge herself. <laughs> over every time. Every time, That's really? That's called never giving up. <laughs> <laughs> okay, then. Conductor, can I get a juice, please? Thank you. <sighs> uh, we're jumping in five minutes. You can have something to drink when it's over. When it's oh, over, not before. Don't worry about me. Mm -hmm. I just want to see if I can stay on my feet this time. Oh, come on. I feel like I'm starting to get the hang of it. <laughs> the key is using your core, waist, <laughs> and leg muscles. It's not your stance that matters, but your ability to ride the inertia. <laughs> okay, then. Well, don't mind me. Find a place to sit down and buckle up. <laughs> I have a feeling we're going to see her fall. Jumps are hey, well. like this. They may feel novel the first few times, but you'll slowly get used to them after a few more. Uh. As for the mechanism, well, if you're interested, I'll explain it to you in detail when we have more time. Okay. Now, just sit and wait. Remember, Remember to close your eyes. Oh. Okay, then. Remember to close my eyes. Got it. Hold on tight and wait for the jump. Hello? Hello, hello? <clears throat> All passengers, please return to your seats. <laughs> the train is about to make a jump. So hold on, everyone. <laughs> I won't fall over. I won't fall over. Four, three, two. Let me guess. <laughs> she falls over, doesn't she? Come on. Come on. Show me March on the floor. Come on. Oh, dang it. millennia. Is this what your Relo 6 has become? Uh huh. So that snowy planet is our destination this time? Mm. Yes. Looks like this trailblazing expedition won't be easy. Eh. Nothing easy is worth it. Star rail stability is down to 12%. Oh no. Schedule alteration. Seven day stop over time extended indefinitely. Oh gosh. Hmm. The complex locality of this world has been affected. affected somehow. The star rail has been blocked off by something. Oh my. Take an ordinary train as an example. It's like the tracks up ahead have suddenly snapped, and the way forward leads straight into a collapsing abyss. Oh, the well that's fun. The do would be to break hard, right? <laughs> right. If we try to force our way ahead, there could be a hefty price to pay. Yep. This again? Don't tell me. <laughs> it's gotta be. Stellar on, isn't it? The results of the preliminary analysis are here. <laughs> the anomaly <laughs> stems from <laughs> Stellar on, as always. As always? Stellar on. Like what's in me? <laughs> yes. Just like the one that's been placed into your body. <laughs> what exactly is a Stellar on? Stellarons are clouded in mystery. Even her uh. isn't able to fully understand them. No? Okay, then. There's no need to worry. This isn't the first time our route has been obstructed by a Stellaron. Even if we don't know much about them, at least we know how to neutralize their influences. Oh, well, that's good. The only thing we can say for sure is that their arrival causes massive changes to civilizations and ecosystems. They also generate distortions in space, such as fragmentums. Hmm. There must fragmentums, be huh? Interesting. connection between the Stellaron we're dealing with here and Urielo 6 becoming a frozen planet. Oh, so it wasn't frozen the last time you were here? Is that Stellarons <laughs> are seeds of disaster, 
planted by a certain eon throughout the universe. We can't hmm. continue to trailblaze without removing the source of the disaster. Now, what does this sound familiar to? Hmm. Ah, the nails. The celestial nails in Genshin. So, if the celestial nails cause disaster locally in Genshin, and Stellaron creates disaster locally in Honkai Star Rail, then... Hmm. Huh. Why can't the people in the world's effect could save themselves? <laughs> it's empowering, looking out at a world from a window like this. Mm. But when you set foot on the planet itself, you realize how small and helpless you really are. Mm. Just, Just like them. Mm. Oof. Wow. I'd like to entrust this trailblazing expedition to March, Dan Hung, and you. Okay. The objective is clear. Find the Stellaron responsible for the disaster and the spatial distortions and bring it back to the Express. We'll deal with the rest. Okay. Awesome! We get to work as a team again! Yay! Oh, wait, 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 wait. That voice actor. Is that Amber? Oh my god, it's Amber, isn't it? You're not coming? Why? Someone has to stay on the train or Pom Pom will get lonely. Oh, the poor thing. Not to mention, Nanook threw us a glance just now. If we're targeted by the Antimatter Legion, then things could go <laughs> south fast. Oh. So, so it's still, still not our time. turn. Yeah. I know you really <laughs> want to go, but we should give the youngsters a chance to <laughs> get out there on their own. It'll be a good opportunity for them to bond. Bond? Mark, oh my. You are ready. Why not go and find <laughs> Dan Hung? Okay. He's probably already started collating the ecological data and survey results for <laughs> Relo 6. It's always good to know more about the destination before you start a journey. Right. Alrighty then. A grand, cool adventure. Nice. Let's go see Dan. Are you doing okay after your first jump? Dizziness or retching yeah. are normal reactions. You'll feel better once you get used to it. Right. I feel fine. So you have high compatibility with the Express. <clears throat> That's good. Yep. I went through the Express's database, and it seems the environment on Urelo 6 has undergone drastic changes in the past few <sighs> centuries. It was not a frozen planet to begin with. I can surmise that. Well, it says it was caused by a Stellaron. Is that so? Hmm. Considering the spatial obstacles that the Star Rail has encountered, Highly possible. I've conducted a preliminary survey and found that there's one area with a relatively <laughs> normal temperature on the surface of the planet. By normal, I mean a temperature <laughs> that just about allows human survival. Oh, so basically Alaska versus Antarctica. On this Himiko wants you, me, and March 7th to go together. As I expected. Before you came, whenever March wanted to go anywhere, Himiko would make Mr. <laughs> Yang and me go with her. And even after uh. you arrived, I didn't suppose I'd be the one to be liberated of that duty. I assume the trailblazing objective this time is to find the Stellaron on Urelo 6 and dispel the effect it's exerting on the Star Rail. Right? Correct. You should find... What do you mean, find March? Wasn't she with me? Okay, fine. Here we go. Did Hi, March. To Don Hung? Full of enthusiasm. Really? I find that hard to believe. <laughs> yeah, I do Relax. too. Don Hung and I are experienced trailblazers. Well, are you ready? Oh, wait. No, 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 no. That's not Amber. That's Yoe Mia. That's Yoe Mia. Oh, my gosh. Dang, I... <laughs> I can recognize characters by their voices now, just how much I played the game. Dang. You bet. When okay. I first saw this planet, I thought a world covered in ice. Could it have something to do with my past? Now I can't stop thinking about it. Ah. Still, the ice that trapped me was six-phased ice, a very rare substance. Hmm. I don't think you can find it on your average planet. Six-phased ice, huh? 
Is that like a um, uh, spatial anomaly type of ice? Probably. We won't know unless we have a look ourselves. To be honest, I think I'd be kind of annoyed <laughs> if I found out this was my home world. It looks freezing. Pretty girls aren't frost resistant. Well, it's a good thing you're not pretty. <laughs> I'm kidding. You're very pretty, March. You're what? very, very pretty. Is there something on my face? No. Nah, I was just imagining all the fun we're going to have here. <laughs> Wait a minute. Is that a primo gem on her? I feel sorry for this world. On her shoulder? Oh, no. First the Stellaron. <laughs> and now you. Oh, no. Let's go. All right. Here comes the Urelo 6 Trailblaze team. Awesome. Here we go. <sighs> Pretty chilly. I love the way the Trailblazer looks here. She just looks really good. One big snowball. Ah. <laughs> snow as far as the eye can see. Which direction should we take? Based on the coordinates, the target should be up ahead. Okay. What are we waiting for? Let's go. Yeah. Why didn't we land at the destination? Uh, do you want to mention the time <laughs> we smashed a hole through Tykean Stadium? Or shall <laughs> Wow, okay so then. Please stop bringing that up. Let's just say that landings and crowds don't mix. Okay then. Unless you enjoy trailblazing through two weeks of community service. I said drop it. Remember, <laughs> we should stay vigilant. We know very little about this world. Okay. Calm down. Between the three of us, nothing will stand in our way. Nothing. I mean, come on. You've got a Celeron in your body. I have my special <laughs> six-phase ice powers. And Don Hung. Uh, <laughs> so if people start creating trouble for us, they're gonna regret it. He's got the mysterious past going for him. Good God. Let's just make sure we're not the ones causing trouble. <laughs> well, let's not get ahead of ourselves. <laughs> let's go. Braving the unknown? <laughs> that's the real spirit of trailblazing. Okay, if you say so. If you say so. Oh. Navigation system. You can travel th between different worlds and areas. Nice. Excellent. Okay. Let's see. Oh, yes. Claim another day. Day five, six, and seven. And we will have enough for a full... <laughs> A full ten pull, hopefully. Let's see. What do we got? We have got let's see. Oh really? Did I already get I already pulled some, didn't I? I must have. I must have. Somewhere, some way. Records. No record. Okay. Oh, wait, did I pull on this one then? Might have. Oh, yeah, that's why. Okay. So, I've already pulled five times. One, two, three, four, five. I will need another two to be able to get members exchange. Stellar trade, and let's do that. Two, three. There we go. I can get a four star in five pulls. Or I can keep going and wait and get a five star, hopefully. Anyway. This place still hasn't been corroded. Yet <laughs> fragmentum monsters have already made it here. Yeah. Mm hmm. I've already made it. Come on. There we go. Excellent. 
I'm overpowered for what this is. No, I couldn't have. What the heck is that? Calyx. Huh. What is this, Mr. Yang? <laughs> Calyx. Okay, then. Hmm. Reality data, huh? Defeat enemies to obtain general materials. Interastral Peace Guide, huh? Ah, Calyx Golden has been archived in the internet. Awesome. Oh, Trailblaze Power. Okay. Ah, interesting. I didn't know that was even something that... Ooh, -hoo. Wait a minute, wait a minute. I can increase challenge waves? Oh my. I think I'll just stick with one for now. E yeah, let's go. Okay. Yeah, there we go. Excellent. And let's the go for that. Life and death revealed in an instant. There we go. It's but a vision. Take out two. Excellent. Just a scratch. Ouch. Just a little something. Think nothing of it. Oh, thanks a lot. <laughs> Come on. Excellent. Okay, then. Adventure log. Oh, so it's like the blossoms of of wealth and, and wisdom that we get in Genshin. Nice. Clear Calyx one times. Excellent. And then claim that. Oh, nice. Excellent. Okay, then. Complete simulated universe world one. <laughs> Alrighty then. That's a pretty good start. Um, I'm going to go ahead and let this part go. Because I got to go um, watch the news with my mom. But I'll be right back for another episode right after this. I promise. We, we watch the news together because it's fun. And because it's just our little thing. So I'll see you later. Love you.